Hey everybody, what's happening? Eddie back again, this time bringing you a little video, a little reaction video to the God of War Ragnarok Combat Let's You Play With Your Food exclusive video from Game Informer. It looks like Game Informer snapped up the exclusive uh, rights to do the pre-promotions uh, pre for God of War Ragnarok on the run-up to it, and they're giving out little tiny little teases of what the game is going to be like, not giving you too much information, and they've posted now a 1 minute and 39 second video that I'm going to I watch here for the first time with you guys. One minute and 39 seconds doesn't sound too amazing. It doesn't sound like it's going to be a big old trailer, but I guess we'll see what happens. I'm guessing it's going to be talking about the different combat styles that are, are new to God of War Ragnarok. I'm excited to see what it's like. So there's only one thing left to do is grab the Leviathan X and watch it. <sighs> I'm ready, boys. <laughs> If you want to see more God of War Ragnarok videos, subscribe to this channel. I've got a few theory videos that I'm going to be putting up pretty soon. And then doing a lot of stuff around launch. It'll be good fun. Join another God of War fan. Go on, you know you want to. Hello, it's Jay from Game Informer. God of War games are known for their expressive, gritty action. And Ragnarok looks to be no different. In fact, two lead oh. combat designers oh, I love this right here. The way he recalls the axe mid-air and drops it down. Great. Play with your food. And you can see how Kratos lives up to that philosophy, grappling ledges with his blades of chaos and launching opponents with the two new Dauntless and Stonewall arm shields. Oh, also they are new shields. Cool, cool, cool. By stunning with arrows, destroying obstructions, swinging his bow, and summoning spectral allies like in the last game. Oh, God, it looks One so good. It's pretty easy to miss unless you're playing is the oh. new ability mapped to the triangle button. By holding Whoa, the shit. triangle, Kratos activates his weapon's signature move. Oh, Depending that on finish whether he up. has a Leviathan axe <laughs> or Blades of Chaos equipped, oh. Kratos can infuse his steel with ice or fire. These elemental moves, called Ooh. Frost Awaken and Whiplash, do extra damage by freezing or incinerating enemies. Nice! Even Sounds though you're an unstoppable ball of rage, one combat designer cautioned that we shouldn't play with all our food. Some food can eat us pretty easily too. Don't tell me what to do. You're not my dad. More info about the new reptilian creatures <laughs> called Grimms or some of the play styles Grimms. you can experiment with. Go to GameInformer.com slash G-O-W Ragnarok <sighs> and be sure to stay tuned for more God of War videos. All right. I think that's going to be the end of the video. Yeah, that is right there. That was, um, that was, it was short. It was short, definitely. And we've seen, uh, that area before. It's not new, but we've got some good information now. I'm going to put it on mute and then play through the video again. Um, yeah, there's a, there's a lot to break up there. So you've got, it did mention the two, two different types of elements that you confuse your, your weapons with. The, to be fair, they had those elements sort of built into them. The, the axe had the frost ability and the blades had the, the fire and whatnot. But if you hold down the triangle button, you can like activate its ability and get extra damage out of it. And I guess freeze enemies or, or incinerate them. That's pretty cool. And when he was spinning it round there, like a, like he was a, like it was, um, uh, like a, I'm not even, I don't even know what word to think of, like a rope dart or something like that. It was pretty cool. Um, I really like the look of that. The other thing was the stone wall, uh, shield and the, what did he call it? Dauntless and stone wall arm shield. So they're actually two new shields. Both of them, I guess, do different things. It looked like the dauntless one is really powerful for knocking enemies back. The, the guy, the, the reptilian thing just flew away. Uh, and oh my God, Jesus Christ. Yeah, he flew really far. And then the stone wall one is like, like, like name suggests stone wall. It seemed to be, you could just put it up and it blocks you from, uh, makes you invulnerable to anything really um it looked really cool they glow red i don't know if that's if that's something if there's like an extra ability in that perhaps i guess we'll find out closer to the game or maybe when the game comes out um but they look really awesome actually do you know what i saw one move right there it looked like it wasn't glowing before the reptilian attacked the stone wall shield and then after it hit it it almost like it gathered that energy and then he slammed it to the ground it could be the way that that works right there cool mechanic if that's true it's really nice so uh, it's, as it says playing with your food so it gives you multiple different ways for you to be able to fight these enemies and uh and beat them and beat them in combat Looks pretty awesome, and um, yeah, different type of of bow from uh, from Atreus right here, or Atreus, as the guy says in the video. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, it seems to be like making uh, walls disappear. I'm um, very specific walls that you you command to. Damn, it looked really cool. 
the flame effects, the jumping off of it. And that was another thing, the different levels as well. That's something that looks really cool as well. It's It seems to have more like levels and more areas in combat for you, as opposed to before where it was pretty much a wide open area and then maybe a ramp or two. This one, you can jump up, up, up on ledges, jump down and land your axe down on somebody. Yeah, the combat looks really good. It looks really good. And to hear these like, like nice little improvements that they've done on a system that was pretty good in the first place i'm not gonna lie i wasn't i wasn't jonesing for anything too specific uh, uh to as in, in ways of improvements in the first game but it looks good it looks real good i love the colors i love this i think this is the i think this is the dwarven city of the word that nobody can pronounce no one can pronounce it it's, in, it's impossible i'll put it on the screen or something like that but yeah it looks really really good i wonder where these enemies have come from and what the hell their deal is anyway thank you for joining me for this uh, reaction video to the god of war combat gameplay video from game informer thank you guys very much for hooking us up with that um if you guys like this sort of stuff feel free to subscribe to the channel like the video and let me know in the comment section what your favorite part was what you liked really much about it. i think my favorite favorite part is obviously how you're going to be swinging that those blades of chaos now just like let's charge it up boys turn on that flame flame on it's pretty cool right there um yeah let me know what your favorite part was and if you want to see more stuff like this subscribe to the channel and as i said more god of war videos coming up pretty soon all right guys catch you on the next one bye